Welcome back to the Eminem Toy Blog, where we are looking at DC Migos DC Teen Titans, and we continue with Wonder Girl. Uh, with the Teen Titans line, Migos started using the nicer, heart like soft rubber boots and gloves. Wonder Girl, of course, doesn't have gloves, but she does have the boots. Easily removable, very nice material, under which we have her red stockings. Let's put your boots back on, Wonder Girl. We got to go out tonight. There we go. I really like her boots. Yeah, the boots. Um, unique boots for the Migos. Female high heel boots yeah. made of a soft plastic. Uh, unique to Wonder Girl. Nice shape, too. Nice shape. Uh, let's look at her, her bodysuit. We have the star pattern on one leg. Just the vibrant red on the other. We have her molded in or sewn on belt uh, into it's a separate piece. I never knew that. My goodness. It is a separate piece. Kind of. That's really cool. I always thought it was part of the fabric. Her star pattern on her torso. We got the little necklace that they gave her, which is molded for, for the swell of her chest. So it kind of rests nicely there uh, instead of kind of. If they molded it just straight, it would kind of look odd. So it's a nice little extra for Amigo. Not extra are her arms made of a kind of soft rubber instead of the usual rubber, the plastic that Amigo did. And they're not articulated at all. Just a, a just rubber arms. And her hair is really good. Her hair is really good. And we know how Camera Girl could be uh, kind of kind of not very uh, gentle with the Amigo female's hairs. Poor odd. Uh, Donna's uh, fellow Paradise Island Amazon Wonder Woman uh, got Camera Girl's ire for her five head, but not such a problem for Donna. Let's take a look at her hair and her cute little unique sculpted face. I think this was a uh, fashion, a, a resculpt of one of the early fashion dolls that Migo did, uh, but it all looks really good. Vibrant colors pop. And the rubber boots make you wonder if the Migo line continued, the Migo superhero line continued. Uh, what kind of boots and gloves and costuming would they have done for new figures? But as we all know, it ended with Teen Titans in 1976. The color is really good. Yeah, that's the when combination. Migo Black fans hair. will say, when you say color, do you think Teen Titans, you think the color. Think of the bright yellow and Kid Flash. Uh, anything else to add there, camera girl? All right. Let's take one more look at the boots. Snaps are perfect. Uh, she's a little hard to stand, which makes it uh, a little challenging. I always lean her against one of her fellow Titans. Uh, at this point in DC history, she got... Oh, there she goes. She got this costume in 1969, replacing her little, like, Wonder Woman onesie that she wore. Uh, so they actually wore that for seven years. Teen Titans had a very short-lived cartoon. Uh, Wonder Girl... So people knew the name Teen Titans, but I mean, they didn't have many episodes at all. So this is a very comic book, cho uh, comic booky choice for Migo to end out their line. And Wonder Girl is a very hard to find figure. Uh, mine is, I think, is in perfect shape. I can't really find a flaw with it. Maybe the hair is a tiny bit messy, but... Not that perfect. Not really. I think it's perfect. Um, so say goodbye to Wonder Girl, as we will see you next time on the NM Toy Vlog. Hit the subscribe button. See you soon. Cute face.